it's an Impacts 101 here um, with Nash right here. And um, we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to load um, all these guns and just showing you how they are and what we have done today. So, the first gun I have right here, which is basically a crossbow, this is not from Nerf, it's from Zing. And this is a crossbow. Um, the arrows are like suction ones. So you shoot it and it will like stick to the walls or windows and stuff like that. So there is a safety button, which is right here. So when you have it in, you just press it and then you shoot it. And then there's a little hole in the arrow that you put right here and that's the biggest one. So now I'm actually going to show you. So this. next gun we have the Raven. This is one of my favorite guns. Easy. Everything I love about it. And I spray painted it, you guys can see. And I, we, I will be showing you a tutorial how to make them look like that. Or I can show you some more, which right now. So on to the next one. Okay, so I have this lightning bow from Nerf, and it is the Mega. See right here it says Mega. And this is a bow now. We um, showed you guys this tutorial in the last video that we did. And um, we just did the knife and the duct tape. Um, so you just pull that. It has a sight if you don't have the arrow in it. You can see it right here. A little orange thing right here. And then you can hold five bullets. So one, two, three, four, and then one more bullet. So on to the next gun. Next gun we have a long shot. This is a cool gun. I like it. And so if you like longer arms, you like it like this. But if you have short arms, like my brother, you like to short. So you just pop it in right Yeah. So it won't come off, but that's all. So I got that, and I love it because I just love the design. And I spray painted this one, yes, as well. You might not want to spray paint the tips because um, you guys have the star, hopefully. So bad. Okay, so I have this Nerf um, Strife. Strife, and it is a battery operated. This stock is not, um, it's, it has an extender stock, so, um, you, like, sometimes it gets uncomfortable, this is bent. Um, it takes batteries right here, it takes four double A's, and this is the barrel, and we spray painted this gun as well as the other ones, and it has a nice rail where you can put scopes and stuff, and then as well on the bottom too, that's where we put this little, I guess, what's it? Grip. A grip. So on to the next guy. Modulus. This is one of my favorites right here. Um, we took this off the demolisher. From the demolisher, which you go in here. So I traded this piece for a um, scope and a drum mag. So I taped a um, flashlight. flashlight to the gun. Just go to the tree, get a nice dollar flashlight, and then get some duct tape. And then you got a flashlight gun, so there we go. Alright, on to the next gun. This is a demolisher. He used to have this stock for the demolisher on that one. Um, but now we have this one. And there is a missile that you put in here, and it came with two, and then you just shoot regular bullets out here. We spray painted this one black, and it's battery operated because you have to shoot the bullets out from here. That's why there's this little button. We don't have a mag for it, but if it's any type of mag, and you can just take the stock off of it. And this was $30? $40. $40. So on to the next guy. We have another way bin, not spray painted. As you can see, a lot of our guns do not have batteries in them because we are buying more batteries, brand new ones. So we have to take off everything and put them new ones in. So that's why I like that. So here's another way bin. All right. So we, oh. so we have this next gun. And it is the Nerf and Strike is this an elite? Yeah, I think. It says like TX3 or something. It's a switch. Um, it has all this tape on it. Um, but anyways, it has these two bullet holders and then you have one right here. This gun does not have a rail on it. You just pull it back like this, the trigger. Um, we did the same thing as we did with the modulus, which take the flashlight, but then we also added a laser that has, an, that has another flashlight and then also a red laser. And then you can pull this thing off with buttons, but it's covered with tape. So we'll show you that in the next upcoming videos. So on to the next cut.
Next one we have Fire Strike Elite. So it has a laser on it. Right there. But um two other photos. So I haven't put flashlight on yet because I don't think it needs it. So no, this, I'll get ten dollars for These it. guns are pretty much the same except this doesn't come off and um it does not have a laser. So I am holding the next one. This is a zombie strike from Nerf. And we just pull back like this. It's really easy to cock. It has it holds three bullets and then also one that you shoot out. So all the other it's four. It's very easy to uh to cock. How much was this gun? It was like sixteen. Sixteen dollars. Came with a strike. And this is really expensive, but you can look on online, they'll probably have something cheaper. So on to the next gun. Next gun we have a double strike. It's pretty cool. Uh, this is one of my pistols. It's easy. And it's really powerful. Uh, we spray painted it black, but we want to leave it a little green. So then it looks like that. And so we put a little tape around it. So it doesn't get in there and ruin it up everything. So, next gun. Alright, so these two guns are the same. So this is going to come as a package. We got these for eight bucks, and it came with four bullets, two for each one. And it also came with this little attachment where you put it on the rail. I mean, on the bottom rail. And you flip it upwards, and the white side is supposed to be facing out. And the one where it says Spoonco, where it has a logo, that should be facing you. And there's a white part that faces out. And if it, and if somebody tries to shoot you, and you have this attached, then you're gonna have a pretty good chance of blocking the bullets. And this was eight bucks. Um, you cannot shoot these without a bullet in it, and you can't uncock it either. So on to the next gun. Next gun we have a modulus. Recon MK2. So I love it. I have customized it. So it did not come with a drum mag, scope, barrel, and this part. It just came with like a short little stop. Bet stock. And so I love it. And yes, I did attach a flashlight laser. and a bigger flashlight. And a bigger flashlight. Really light. powerful. And a flashlight. So next one. Okay. So this gun does not have to have a magazine. It just has a small, um, I guess not barrel, um, what is it? A shotgun shell. shell. And it comes with three of those. Well, actually four. So you can put one in here and then you have three extra on the stock. So you just open it like this and you don't even have to cock it. So you just pull it back and you're ready to go. Next gun. Next gun we have does not have a name on it. I think it has a name, but it's not saying here. It's Boom Co. Back from the last, it's a. It says 30 on the side, but. So, it comes with three of these. These are 10 each, so you have 30 rounds, so it's a cool gun. Okay, this one is the Nerf Stock Aid, and it's from the Main Strike Elite. And um, you just open this. Um, you can see all your bullets, and um, if your gun gets jammed, you can just also take the bullets out. Um, it has a nice rail on top. You can just put scopes. This is battery operated. It takes three double A's, and um, this thing is, um, you have to switch this to shoot it. And then the stock on here is like an extender, so if so you stop. have longer arms, you can just do it like this. But if you're a little kid and you have short arms, you can just do it like that. So on to the next gun. Next gun we have the Vortex. It is this gun. So I got it for I think 30. It has this little mag. It's cool. Pop it in. And if you just push these buttons like this, it comes in that. But it will not come out if you want to. So I like it. It's nice. Alright, so we have this Batman vs. Superman Kryptonite gun. It's based from the movie Batman vs. Superman, and that came out about two months ago. And it's this this is a Boomco gun, so you cannot shoot it because it has no bullets in it, and it comes with eight places to hold extra bullets. So it comes with nine bullets altogether because you can carry one in here. This was about um, fifteen dollars at um, Target. We got it for Easter for my brother.
because we all got to pick out each other's gifts and you don't want to miss for a long time. So on to the next gun. Next gun we have, she's not so what it is, like the code is not do that, I think. And so you, so it, this is a little keychain you guys can see, it's really cool. And there's duct tape around it because it snaps off pretty easy. So you just push this button as you, it won't go not back down. So you push the button, it'll go down. It's like and a fold then, up. Yeah, folds and then you have keychain, keychain up and more. So love it. All right, so we have this one, and it's the Nerf In Strike. This is also a map, I believe. It's a what? Maverick. It's a Maverick Rev Five. No, Ma Maverick Rev Six. You just cock it like this, and we spray painted this one. Just don't spray paint this part, or else it'll screw up the gun really badly. Just cock it, and then this also comes out, so you can just push it out and then pop it back in, and you're ready. So next gun we have the same gun. We did not spray paint one. So same thing. Okay, so I have the Mega Big Shock from Instrike, and this is Nerf gun. And you just cock it from the bottom. It's the it uses the same bullets as the um, Mega Lightning Strike bow. And um, you have another bullet in here, but if you don't want to carry a bullet, um, you have a small sight. And um, we did attach lasers. That's why it has all these marks because we put tape on it. And um, it was eight bucks at part. So on to the next one. Here we go, guys. We have the. Um, super so good, it's off. And so uh, they're cool. Cool guns. So my sister's going to be showing you guys just some pieces. Okay, so, 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 so this piece went to the Boom Co. set that I was showing you guys. Be right back, guys. Alright. Um, and you just attach, attach it to the bottom rail. And it's supposed to be, it's supposed to face this way. White facing out. Um, if I can grab the Boom Co. gun, I can show you guys. So you just would attach it to the bottom rail, which I don't know. So you just attach it to the bottom rail, um, any side. And then, um, now if you did it the wrong way, it'll come out like that. So you have to do it this way, then you can flip them forward. So there. So it should look like this. And then, um, since Boomco bullets are like, Kind of a rubbery feeling at the end. You just, um, other people who are shooting at you, it'll just catch this, and you'll have a less of a chance of getting shot in the underfoot. So, then the next pieces we have, um, they do make these, um, and you can buy them at the stores, um, but they're kind of expensive, so we just came up with our own. We just taped a small one and then a big one, so you can just put it in a gun, and then once this one is empty, you can just flip it over. And put it in there, and it's a really cool creation. I love this snap. So now he's going to show you um, two more pieces that come with the. We models. have a tripod. Works pretty cool. Just goes on like any other piece. So that's done. And then we have a set. I bought this at Target. Has a little laser, and it takes batteries, and I'll just unscrew right here. It's cool. I love it. Okay. So we have a bunch of these barrels, and these do have rails, and you can also detach them from your guns. We have two of these. We bought these on eBay. We got three of these guns with three of these barrels um, for 30 bucks, and it came with the, um, it also came with the socks too, like we had on the other guns. And then these two we spray painted. Um, what gun does this go to? Modulus. The modulus. And we spray painted this, and this one as well. Is this a silencer? Yeah. And this is a silencer. So he's gonna he has three more parts. So let's go. So this one is cool because it can be a grip. And if you don't want to get a grip, you use this little button right there. Push it, pop back like that, and we'll not come back to do that. So that's cool. And then I have a silencer. This is my friend, she left it here. No, this is mine. Right. They have the same guns. So Yeah, so this one's mine. And it's pretty cool, I like it. I love this bit. So, and then we have this. This has batteries. You um put these glow dots, and so you just do that. And it goes into the Raven, but we just took it out and put it in a different one. 
So you put it in, and the bullets glow. And the bullets, when you shoot them, they glow. So it's really cool. Um, okay, so I have this gun that went to the sling fire, and this was a shotgun shell, and it comes with four of these, and it just holds three bullets, and it's kind of like a train drill piece. You can see. Then we have this, um, is this a silencer as well? I think this is. No, it's just a pill. Oh, okay, um, I'm not very good with this stuff, but some of it I am. Um, so this is just another barrel. Um, it has a rail at the bottom, and, um, and the grip yeah, and then... I have this Nerf sword, and this is the Enforce. Um, we just taped it because it was falling apart. We got this, so we bought this from somebody a long time ago, so it's already been used a lot, and, as you can see. So, on to the next items. I have a six mag. Oh, one of those baby mag things. Pretty cool. Eighteen mag. Another six. And then we have... Good. This one goes on to the modulus. Um, let's see. We just wait to this gun, guys. So this thing goes, but I thought it was way too short. So if you can see, way too short. So I like it longer. So I took that off. And then this. And so that's it, guys. So. Um, I'm going to be talking about, I'm back, I'm going to be getting an extra piece of each other. Oh, uh, no, we're done. Okay, so, um, since we're done, that is it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to, um, comment down in the comment section below if you have any more videos that you suggest that we should do. Give this video a big thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Bye.